Hi, you have tuned into the Raging Agon channel, and I'm your host, Jingis, and I'm here with episode 10 of our uh, Glaze Nuzlocke. And in today's episode, guys, we're going to do. Well, first off, we are going to do the gym, and then we're going to. Well, and then we have two months that we might be able to catch, uh, but before going to the gym, we're going to do a quick team recap because something has changed. Uh, I did some grinding, and then we all also have a lot of money right now. Uh, so let's go and see uh, here first. Let's do this quick. First out, we have Flareon, our Flareon. We will give it a new name, of course. Uh, but we will do that later on. So it's just Flareon for right now. Uh, Flash Fire, Naive Nature, Holding No Item, Rocking Return, Quick Attack, Sand Attack, and Growl. Then we have Drogo, our Marsh Top at level 29 with Torrent, Bashful Nature, Holding No Item, Rocking Mudshot, Growl, Return, and Water Gun. Then we have Henry, our shiny Breloom at level 26 with effects for Quirk and H, holding no item, rocking Mag Punch, Return, Leaf Blade, and Leech Seed. And then last but not least, we have the King, our Haunt at level 29 with Levitate, Gentle Nature, holding no item, rocking Thunderbolt, Shadow Punch, Spore, and Nightshade. Uh, we're actually going to lead with Henry here in today's episode. Uh, I'm going to show you just how much money we actually got. Well, not, uh, well, I didn't want to say, I want to show you how much money we got. We got 25,000, uh, because I trained in the lighthouse, and then you get, like, for the first two guys, it combined, like, 24,000 every time you battle them, and you get a lot of XP as well, so that was just good, good for us. Uh, so I want to buy, let's see here, we can buy a ton of them, but I want to buy super potions first, in form of, I want to buy 17, if I can do that, how much will that be? That'll be, uh... A bit more than well, it'll be around half. Then we can get the rest on Pokeball I mean, on Great Balls, actually. Yeah, let's do that then. Put them on uh, 20 of them, and then we get the rest. Uh, here we get nine then. Then we get more. Okay, we can get 22 of them. We have nine though, so let's go for. Len gives us 20 if we go down there. Then we have 30 Pokeballs, and that should be enough for a good amount of time. Yeah, but then we actually need to buy some antidotes and paralyzed seals and so forth as well, so... Let's get down to 16, so we're up to 5. Okay, I've got another uh, We don't have too much here, I'm going to buy... God, not so many. Uh, let's buy 5 of these. Let's buy 3 of you. Awakening. We can buy 3 as well. And I can... Put the rest on Great Balls again. I can buy three of those. Okay, that's good. I'm fine with that. I've got a lot of healing items and a lot of Pokeballs as well, which is always good. Time. We have 20 hard potions, two potions, five awakenings. Uh, five paralyzed seals. I'm going to move you up uh, there. Uh, five awakenings, five paralyzed seals, and five antidotes. Now we have some other things as well. Yeah, as you see, we had two Fire Stones. I used one to evolve Flareon, our EV to Flareon. Uh, then we have seven Pokeballs and 28 Great Balls. That should be enough for a long time. We should be fine. Uh, now, I'm just going to read here. Certain to Isle Terry, the de dedicated archaeologist. Okay, so this is other rock ground. It was what I thought. Uh, that is why we're going to lead with Henry in here. Uh, hopefully, we get to a good level before uh, we fight everyone. Well, why we fight everyone in here? Because that's the uh, object of today, is actually to defeat this gym. And then we can get some new encounters as well. And if it is that Henry can't defeat this gym by himself, we actually have some help in the back uh, with some other pretty hard hitting mons with stab uh, super effective. But it looks... I think Henry will be able to sweep this team pretty easy. We have Sand Slash. The Sand Slash might be able to survive this hit. Because this is pretty physically defensive. It, it's, it is actually very, very broken, so it might survive. Yeah. Defense curl. Okay, I'm just gonna mock Punch. When I am fast, I don't really need to mock Punch, but I'd rather mock Punch because that has the uh, most PP. Out of all of our moves, that's 30. Compared to what, 15 on the lead play. So yeah, that feels better. And we're almost got level 27 all around. Alright, I'm glad that I didn't level up Henry as well for this gym. That I decided to use Henry uh, in the gym. 
other than... Yeah, you understand what I mean. Let's just explore. Uh, I think this is the fast way, the fast track. <laughs> but let's see, it only has one Pokemon and it's a Gligar. That could be a bit problematic for Henry. Especially if it has a... Uh... Okay, it has a quick attack. I don't think it has a super effective move on us. I don't think it has a fly attack move. Maybe Peck. Win attack maybe, but I don't think that will do much. That's hard on. Okay, we'll be able to survive this attack, but it won't be able to su survive the next. I really need to. Yeah, we should be able to mock punch him to death. Yeah, good. Good, 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 good. And we're level 27 with Henry. And we should actually be on par with the Jun. We defeated him pretty easy. So let's run up here and see if we, there's no one else we can hear we can fight. Okay, that's just luck. Uh, okay, let's do that and let's go down this one then. I think that's the right one. Nope, that was the wrong one. Oops. I actually like this design a lot of this gym. It's actually pretty nice. Uh, if we go down here, we're going to fight you. Okay, good. Let's fight you then. Not for dropping down those holes, right? Well, it, I don't mind. If we're fighting you guys and winning easily, I don't really mind that. You have a Sound Slash as well. Sound Slash should die from this uh, Leaf Blade, and if it doesn't, we have Mock Punch. I mean, it doesn't really matter. Yeah, oh, that was crit. Good god. Then you're completely destroyed, Sound Slash. You can't really do anything then. We're soon at level 28, which is actually pretty darn good. That uh, did level up the rest of his team, uh, so he didn't have to use the experience here on everyone here. Uh, I'm just going to run up to the gym leader as well and defeat him while we are doing this here. Because I don't I don't feel like I need to run back and heal. He already has a Marsh Dump. Marsh Dump is going to get swamped. By this, by this leaf blade. It's going to get so swamped. No berry to save it, no, le <laughs> no focus ash, it's by by Marsh Stomp. We almost hit level 28, we should hit level 28 in the next battle. Uh, that is right here, and then we have the gym leader left only, I think. Uh, let's see what he has for... Well, he might have a fossil, this guy. He has two mounts and he has a Needle King, a level 25 Needle King. That's actually pretty scary. Um, this is neutral though, but focus energy, okay, that is a bit scary, but this is neutral and then we have a. Yeah, this should do over 50%. I'm pretty sure at least. Oh, poison. I mean, it's fine for me because we have the healing items. I don't think he can kill us even. Well, a quick peck might actually kill us. Um. Mark Punch will kill from there, so I'm actually I actually have to switch out here, and I would think I'm going to... Uh, I'm actually going to go to Drogo. That feels better. It feels safe. Yeah, he has to pick. Uh, let's actually just water gun him. Fresh! I'm so glad I went out to Drogo. Holy fuck. Fresh Needle King is very, very scary, guys. <laughs> Especially in this game. Henry's level 28 at least, that's always good to see. Counter? No, you're not going to learn Counter. Hell no. Yes. Oh my god. Why would you want to learn Counter? It's like the worst possible move on you. Well, not really, but almost. It's pretty bad. Double kick, we eat that for days because Drogo is bulky. Mudshot should lower the speed of Needle Queen so we can outspeed it and then we should kill it next turn with Water Gun. I think we can lift the Water Gun, please. And we outspeed it at least, so let's see here. Yeah, we do. Good. Yeah, he was actually pretty hard to deal with. Got 1500 though, so I'm not gonna. I'm not mad about that. Uh, we have the Jubilee. I'm actually just gonna run back. Oh god, I forgot about him. Uh. I mean, then, you want to run back and heal? Uh, yeah, I'm actually gonna run back and heal. 
it feels better that way. It actually does. I said I didn't want to, but I'm actually gonna do it. I guess we can speed up, because it's pretty simple mechanics. <laughs> like, it's nothing there you can see, really. Uh, so let's go back into the gym, and let's face the gym leader. And when we have faced the gym leader, we should be good to go for the rest of the episode. This actually went a lot faster than I thought it would do. I thought this would take like 20 minutes, maybe. So let's save before we face the gym leader. Oh yeah, and actually I managed to solve the problem with my computer. Uh, the problem was that I had uh, too many programs open while I was recording, so my recording software has turned off. Uh, here we have Terry. <coughs> Let's see, what voice should I give him? Need voice. Hello, and welcome to the Serenity Isle game. My name is Terry, the use of the wonderful ground pipe. Let's see if you can withstand the pressure while the very ground beneath your quivers. <laughs> that sounded so... <laughs> that was the most menacing thing I've ever heard someone speak with that voice. <laughs> it will lead through the Gligar. Okay. Uh, I'm just gonna leave with him. Like, my thought process is that he does not have anything to hit me with. If he does, Henry's going to die. Okay, yes, has protect. Good, 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 good. I'm fine with that. Both have toxic or toxic heal, though. Let's go for the leaf blade. We are faster. That's good to see. Let's see how much we do to him. 50% magnitude, magnitude 7. We should be able to eat that up because we're a grass type. Even if magnitude 7 is. Yeah, we eat that. The Gligar should die from this hit. Yeah, that was a crit. Okay. That was actually pretty good that we got the crit. Just to secure the kill. Here we have a Vibrava. Vibrava is buggy ground, I think. Not 100% sure, I think it is. So, grass is. Well, it's actually neutral here as well, but he might have something to hit us with that it's super effective on us. Oh, never mind! Bye bye, Vibrava. <laughs> I did not think that would kill. Then we have a Fampy. I'm not gonna switch out, I should be faster than Fampy. And I don't think, unless it is evil like Fampy, it should not survive a Leaf Blade. But maybe it does, that's level 29. Yeah, okay, there was no way to survive that. I mean, I'm fine with that, that was pretty good, I guess, I have to say. It did splendidly. This badge is rightfully earned by you. Yeah, we got a good amount of money from him as well. I played the Dark Badge. With that badge, trade a Pokemon. Oh, wait. With that badge, trade a Pokemon up to level 5 will obey you. Take his team as well, courtesy of me. Yo, did you give us Earthquake? That team contains Earthquake, the strongest ground. <laughs> wow. Okay, I got some monsters that can use Earthquake. Um, uh, for example, Drogo. Okay, Drogo's the only one. <laughs> Yes, you're going to learn Earthquake. Bye bye, Mudshot. Oh my god. We have DQ. Well, thank you for this. I'm just going to speed out, out of the gym. I'm going to do this. And now we are going to. Uh, we actually have two things to do. Uh, right now we have two months to try and capture. The first one will. Well, that was the wrong one. I want to go in here. And I'm going to uh, leave with the king. Uh, the first one will be all the way back here, uh, down a bit uh, at the uh, the professor's cape. I forgot what the name of it. Forlorn cape, maybe? Yeah, forlorn cape. I don't really care if I have a can just run pretty easy from them, especially with King because he's fast. And for those of you that wonder how to evolve the King in this game. Uh, the only thing you do is that you wait for around the 5th gym, and then you win some skiing competitions, and then you can get how many stones as you want to, more or less. Four long cape. We have not gotten an encounter yet. Uh, we should have enough. We have a lot of Pokeballs, we should have enough for that. We have... Uh, because I think they're pretty low level. Uh, and we have... Uh, spore on you, so we should be able to... to 
uh, put it to sleep and then just take it in. So let's see what we get here. Services. Oh, bell dumb. The only problem is that it's. Oh, that's actually pretty good. Hmm. I'm gonna spoil you. Yo, Beldum is not bad. Beldum is not bad at all. That's a great encounter. Only problem is that we will conflict with the encounter that we might get later in this episode. Yo, Beldum is a really good one. One, a two. Ah, don't wake up. Good. Then we're just going to speed that. And let's see here if we can get it this time. Hopefully we do. It is, after all, a build up. One. Nah. I think. Uh, I can't attack it because it will die if I attack it. Like, the only thing I have that might not kill it is the quick attack. But I'm pretty sure that quick attack will kill it. And I mean, we should capture it in Great Ball as it is, so. I'll... Uh, I'm not that concerned about us not catching it in Pokeball. Oh yeah, and Tekla doesn't affect us either. So this is actually the best possible encounter we could have gotten. That is the only downside of using... They would... Put the Beldum. That was the only downside with uh, having a Beldum here, because it only has Takedown. But it's a good Pokémon to have. When Beldum gather in Swarm, they move in perfect unison as if they were but one Pokémon. They communicate with each other using brain waves. Give a nickname to the Beldum. Hell yeah, we're going to name it the only uh, nickname that you can name it. Professor X. I was going to see if I can spell it right. Pro... Professor... You should be fine. Professor... Ah. Ah. X. Yeah, okay. I think that's how you spell Professor. I'm not 100% sure. It might be you know, double F's and one S. Uh, but let's see here. No, it's not. That's actually pretty good. Good. Could be good. But I wasn't 100% sure if that was how he spelt it, but yeah. So let's name him that. Guess we got the Forlorn Cave Encounter. And I'm actually gonna add him to the team for right now. Well, yeah, I'm actually gonna do that. So let's see what this is. Steel Psychic Clear Body Sassy Nature. No item takedown. It's a good one. Could've been worse. It could've been worse. I'm gonna happily go to take that. Uh, and then we're just going to run this way because I need to go to a computer. Uh, and I need to go to a computer. And I need to fetch our dead socks. Sadly, I have to do that. Come on. I hate speed up sometimes. Then I actually can heal as well. Let's do that. Let's heal up fast. Uh, let's move Pokemon. Let's take up you here. Withdraw. Do that. Now we're just going to run back to the town. And then we're going to do some... Uh, some fun hunting. We're going to run back up here, and we're going to take... Is it this town, or is it the other town that you have to take it from? I think it's the other town, actually, but this is still the fastest way to, the, to that town, so it doesn't really matter. Um, I was so close to catch that Shroomish with a throw Pokeball on that Shroomish. <laughs> uh, the good thing is that the next Pokemon that we want to catch should not uh, be... ...dead by... Quick attack from uh, Flareon. Uh, let's go to Ocean View City. And let's go down here and use our wish ticket. And now we're at Wish Island. And if you didn't know, we can catch the wish Pokemon Jirachi here. And that's what, who we are going to try and catch today. So let's save again. Just in case something happens. Let's save, let's save. The time is 13.37, we have paid 13 hours and 37 minutes, we're elite guys. 
Uh, I'm just gonna see here, we are still leading with the king. We have Spore, we are fast, it should hit, and then we can go into Flareon for free, more or less, and then we can quick attack it. Yeah, let's do that. So yeah, let's fight the Sirachi then, and let's see what happens. Hey, when did humans discover my secret island? I guess only showing up once a millennia has six downsides. Hey, wait a sec, the post will close down! Why would I? You are a Jirachi, I wanna catch you, you know? I really wanna catch you. Okay, uh, let's put him to sleep. Look at the helping hand, I don't really care about that. I'll put you to sleep. I'm going to click uh, Nightshade. Let's see how much that does to him. Okay, let's go for a uh, quick attack with Flareon. We should be able to get two off without killing him. Yeah, we should. So that's good. Now let's go out into the king, and the king again here. It walks up and uses rests. It has rest. Go for Shadow Punch, and let's see if that this does less than. Okay, it does exact same amount. Because that did less than those, and that, then it could have gone for another. But it doesn't really matter. We can go for another one. You can use Confusion, I don't really care. You want to click Quick Attack here. That's. Oh god, it went for Swift. Okay. I'm just gonna click uh, Great Ball here. I'm sorry for speeding up, guys. Show you, he did that. Okay, 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 okay. Please come to you and don't click rest. You have two turns to not click rest. Of course you click rest! You stupid idiot. I'm going to kill it with the, with the, that. Sucks. Okay, so let's quick attack him. He's going to wake up, he's going to click swift. He's going to quick attack him. And he's going to click confusion. I'm fine with that. I'm going to go out into the king here. Don't click. Rest. You click Confusion. Good. Now, I'm gonna click Spore. Thank you. Okay, now we have a chance to capture him. Now we have a chance to capture him. Let's see here. Nope. We did not capture him that turn. Nope. Let's try these two first, then. Ooh, that was close! That was close! And he's... Okay. Spore. We are faster. Good, 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 good. Yo, I so want to see Roger on my team. Nope. It's fast asleep still. Okay. Great balls, they will come. You can continue to use Helping Hand. I don't really care about that. I really don't, Jirachi. Come on. Come on! Uh, it doesn't even stay in the ball. Okay, I'm going to take Spore here. Then I'm going to heal up. Uh, because I really need to. Flareon can still take heat hits for days from Jirachi, so that's not the problem. Okay, let's see here. One, two, three. Yes! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Because we got to say for Jirachi. Jirachi is said to make wishes come true. When it sleeps, a tough crystalline shell envel envelopes the body to protect it from enemies. Would you give a nickname to Jirachi? Yes, I'm going to give it a nickname. But what nickname should I give it? Uh, actually, since it's like it had tears and it was like it didn't want to get captured, I'm just gonna name it Sorrow. Soros transferred to someone's piece, it was placed in box death. No, it's not bad. Okay, so let's travel back here. We're going to go back and we're going to check him out. In the poke center. Before we do that, though, let's do this. Uh, someone's PC. Let's move Pokemons. Let's do this. Let's uh, move. 
do that, let's do that, let's do that. And then we can go in here. Uh, do no, and then we can see here. We got the Jirachi, that was actually really, really nice. You are bold nature, down attack, up, uh, down attack, up, uh, uh, down attack, up defense. Not the best, but Serum Grace is always a good one. None here, pretty good stats overall, though it doesn't really matter too much. Confusion, Rest, Swift, Helping Hand. This is actually a pretty good set to have on it. Um, so the, now we have two exact the same. Uh, okay, I'm going to look up some stuff, and then we can decide on who to add to the squad. Unless we add both, of course, but I don't really want to do that. Well, that was the wrong run. I don't want Generation 1, I want Generation... Well, it doesn't really matter. I just want to know when it evolves. That's about it. And the rest of the movesets doesn't really matter to me. Build them evolves at level 20. To Metang, and then it should, and then it should learn Confusion Metal Claw. Yeah, so it learns Confusion and Metal Claw at level 20. That could actually be pretty darn good to have. And if we go into Yurachi, uh, it learns Psychic at level 20. Then it doesn't learn a really good move, but I mean. If it, just if it gets Psychic, it's a good Pokémon to have, and we can always give it TMs. I'm going to wait. Like, I don't really want to use Legendaries right off the bat. Um, so I'm going to box Sorrow for right now and use Professor X, I feel like. Level him up to the rest of the squad. Unless I should have both, because they are kinda... I could add both until we get the new encounter, so we have a team of six. But I mean, they have the same weaknesses. Like, I am very, very ground weak right now, in my opinion, if I add both of them. But at the same time, they are pretty, like, I'm pretty, not dark weak, because they resist that both. Well, it's neutral on them. Uh, you know what, I'm going to add both to the team. I'm going to do that. Let's heal up, let's add both to the team. And we have a team of six now, which is great. So, thanks for watching this episode, guys. Uh, I will see you next time. Hopefully, let's see here. Yeah, thank you. I will see you next time.